Right. Let's see which one of us can touch his toes. Right over from the hips, brothers and sisters, please. So, anybody new who's coming across this, what's going on here? Who am I? What am I about? Why have I got flat level earth in the title? Well, you know, get through a wee bit of it. First and foremost, what you have to understand is that that's the default position. The, def the default position, the position for anybody, is that they experience the earth as a level plane. That's what you're experiencing. The geometry that's assumed in pretty much every facet of practical living is that we exist on a plane. So what you have to understand first and foremost is, is that that's the default position. The claims that are coming towards people like myself or you, regardless of whether you've been you've been born into it, bought into it, you know, from a young age and you were told and it was reaffirmed to you, these statements were made to you, images were presented to you. And that's by the by. I start from the default position, and so should you. I am the skeptic, I am the questioner of claims. I'm not here to push any fantasy on anybody. I have no religious connotations, no religious affiliations, no religious bias or political or any other motive other than establishing the objective truths. That's what I want. There, brother. That's what I want. Right over cannot produce any practical references for any of its claims. It cannot substantiate any of the professed physics, physicalities of this oblate spheroid. As I've stated many times before, it exists only as a concept, two-dimensionally, on paper, represented by an apparent three-dimensional image through your screen. That is not a scientific inquiry. It is not in the grounds of proper exploration science. That's what I want. Proper exploration, as I said before, requires demonstrations of substance. That's what I want. Not linguistically based, you know, rhetorical gibberish. That's exactly what the globe model will offer you. You're not trying. The science that it incorporates is the science of sophistry. Not being trying to intimidate and sweet, gullible, weak-minded individuals who don't have proper discernment and to adopting a belief and representing and standing by that belief. That's a cult, that's a religion, I am not interested in any of it. That's what I want. 